when most of us are inside, he's outside. It's an absolute passion. But it wasn't always that way. Lightning was one of the scariest things growing up. You see a bolt of lightning and then you hear the rumbling and the crashing of the thunder and it was pretty scary as a kid. But as I grew up, I started getting a fascination about it. In 2008, Joseph Mandeville took some classes at Gulf Coast State College and became a certified storm chaser. With camera in tow, he snaps some of the most breathtaking pictures many have ever seen. It makes me feel great. I mean, when you're, when you're taking pictures of lightning, when you see a flash of lightning and you think, oh, I just saw one bolt. But when you look at the picture on the screen, you notice there's five, sometimes even six bolts, but you never saw it. You only saw one. That's what really gets me. And of course, the job is not without its risks. Sometimes it does get pretty, pretty scary. I know uh, August 18th of last year, I was at St. Andrews State Park and lightning actually struck a foam pole about 20, 30 yards away from the truck window. Oh my God, it just struck that phone pole in front of me on the camera. And if his name looks familiar, Mandeville is no stranger to TV news viewers. It's a real good thrill seeing your pictures on the news than that, because it gets you exposure, and plus a lot of my friends and family will snap a shot and say, hey, I saw you on the news. Some devastating wind surprised some beachgoers early this afternoon. A water spout carrying enough power to rip off a of roof came barreling ashore shortly after one o'clock on the west end of the beach. I've called for some water spouts, some hail, some damage down, but a lot of times I'll call News Channel 7, Chris Smith and people like that, and then they'll relay it to the National Weather Service. Mandeville says CNN once paid him $250 for that same footage of the water spout he shot in Panama City Beach. An amateur photographer in Florida had a close call with a twister. He first spotted a water spout off of Panama City. It hit land and turned into a tornado heading straight Great for him. But don't expect Joseph to run. When that next storm hits and you're inside your home hunkering down, it's probably a good bet. Joseph Mandeville is outside chasing it down. I love it. I, I won't change anything about it. In Panama City Beach, Ron Morosco, News Channel 7.